Alright, so I'm gonna try and record this video as fast as I can because my mic keeps disconnecting because my headset has been falling apart, literally. So, just, if I am speeding over and glazing over things, just ignore it. But anyway, let's talk about the clown emoji. It's like the most popular thing on Instagram for the month of July and a little bit of August. It's kind of over now. Sorry, I was just scrolling through Instagram while saying that. It's kind of been like the meme of the summer, I'd say. Like, everyone who is anyone is oh my god what the fuck is this when it's book fair week oh that is so epic okay as i was saying basically it's become like the thing of the summer at least it feels like it basically if you don't know what the clown emoji is or the meme i guess whenever someone does something really dumb or just something that's just so idiotic and just is being a total like cunt online what you would do is you would spam them with a clown emoji and it's, you know, you've probably seen it. It's definitely one of the most disgusting looking emojis. It's just like, like, it's just like the design of it. It's like, no, I don't know if that's just me, but like, I really, I'm not afraid of clowns. I just really hate the emoji, but people, but what people would do. And I actually did this for a little bit. I haven't done it in a while now. Whenever someone gets into an argument. Whenever someone gets into an argument with someone or just whenever someone posts something that's like unfunny or like you kind of get the point, I guess they just spam them with clown emojis just to show them that who's boss. They're the, you know, they're the clown. And like I said, I did this for a little bit. I know it may seem like childish and all that, but I did do it like at the beginning of the summer because it was like a meme. And like I said, I haven't done it in a while, but recently the clown emoji has for better and for worse been getting a lot of i guess hate and it makes sense too because a lot of like 14 year olds will just whenever they're losing an argument regardless of if they're on the right side or the wrong side they'll just spam clown emojis like it's literally the clown has become its own meme like you know remember back in early like january of 2018 when ugandan knuckles was still a thing and then it like and then like two weeks after, it became its own meme that actually I think almost like eclipsed the original to just make fun of Uganda Knuckles because it's not funny, it's cringy. Haha, <laughs> wow, look, it's funny like VR chat Knuckles wandering around saying, do you know the way? And whenever someone says something to do with like a clown, even if it's not the emoji, they'll just post under it like images like, haha, <laughs> funny clown moment, and then like stuff like that. And I think that after the clown emoji kind of lost its like, I guess, touch of being like just this thing that you use on people who are just being really toxic online, it has become toxic itself. So people who are toxic will use it when they're losing the arguments. So that's why, in my opinion, and a lot of other people feel this way, the clown emoji meme is dead and should we should just move on from it because it's... Just whenever you post a clown emoji now, or just anything to do with a clown, you just, you immediately get made fun of just because of the clown. I should just like start a counter for every time I say clown from this point on. But anyway, even if you aren't toxic and you're just posting the clown emoji like ironically or something like that, you still look toxic because every, like, like I said, every 14 year old on Instagram is just going to spam clown emoji in an argument they're losing. It's like the thing that really toxic people do now. So unfortunately, that's another thing that we have to throw in the trash because, well, I mean, not gonna lie though, the meme wasn't even that funny to begin with. It was just kind of like, oh wow, you are a clown, epic. But yeah, I say that it's time just to end it. Just no more clown emojis. Even ironically, it needs to die. I don't even think this video is gonna do anything, but I'm just kind of sharing my thoughts. I really feel like we should just completely just leave it. As a community of epic funny memers, I think it's time to officially kill this really epic meme. Now I only really used the clown emoji in like two different instances and that was like the first time it was when I just, you know, just kind of wanted to just make someone pissed off who was just like being like a dick. And the other time I used it was when I was talking to someone who DM'd me on Instagram who was being extremely racist. like. They were saying that we should be anti-immigration and all that, and it was just like, I just, I had, I had to use it then. Like, that was the one time where I had to use it. But I still do regret using it, because something that I realized after, like, literally only a few days ago, I completely forgot that this happened, and it makes me feel really shitty. Basically, if you remember the whole Etika situation, one thing that people kept doing to Etika before he, or I guess just the things that people were doing in his live streams that 
was making him feel more shitty was posting clown emojis. And after I realized that, that was just sort of when I was just like, I can't, I can't believe I actually did that. Now, I'm not trying to like seem like I'm innocent in this, but like, I do think that I never used it in the context that those people were using it in the stream. Like, that's fucked up. You should never use it like that when it's just like cancel culture and all that, you know? Especially when someone's going, especially when someone's going through mental health problems. It's just, it's not worth it. But anyway, after that, I just, I just decided that I just, I, I can't use it anymore. Like, even in like an ironic case, I just, I can't. It just, it doesn't feel right. And not that like it felt right before, I just, I didn't realize it and I should have realized it. And I know this may seem like I'm going too in depth over like a clown emoji, but I'm just saying that's the main reason why I stopped using the, the clown emoji itself. But anyway, the meme is dead and people who use it now are most likely either doing it really ironically or doing it because they're really toxic. So I think it's just time to just leave it. Anyway, I'm sorry I haven't uploaded for a long time, guys. I was just, I've been thinking about videos to make and I've been working on my own passion projects since that are different from YouTube. And I was just thinking about this today and I just kind of wanted to talk about it because it was the only thing that I really wanted to talk about. But anyway, I hope you did enjoy and if you did, make sure to leave your thoughts in the comments. And as always, see you.